Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is G with G's Android Apps, and I'm doing a, another video for Clash of Clans. Guide for the newbies. Uh, a couple things I wanted to point out. Obviously, as you can see, I've gone ahead and I'm sorry, I've, I have gone ahead and upgraded to the Town Hall 3. I'm thinking about doing a video where it shows like what town halls you should consider skipping or what town halls you should consider maxing out. I mean, I'm a big fan for maxing out your town halls, but there's some things that you just want to hurry and get to and not have to wait for. Like for example, town hall 3 should be the first thing that you should try to rush to. The reason being is because one of the most important features in the game, you're able to build your clan castle. Now your clan castle is going to take 40,000 gold so you're going to have to of course get your gold store just built up to be able to hold that amount of gold. only worked on it a little bit, I was just trying to rush to get goblins as well. That's another thing that you want to try to make. When you're a lower level, you shouldn't have to worry about chasing trophies. worry more so about getting goblins because goblins go straight for resources when you get the resources it doesn't even matter what your trophy count is this that before worry about your trophy count later uh, you personally I don't think you should be worrying about your trophy count until you get somewhere around town hall 9 really 8 or 9 if not it really shouldn't be anything that you worry about have fun uh, farm for resources and that's really that way you're using the resources to build your base that's really the more so important part of the game now what I should have did is go ahead and purchase the walls but I did it so I'm gonna have to wait until that storage up here is done again saving all of my uh, builders that way I'm sorry saving my gems in order to get that next builder. The next builder is available at 500 and then after that it's a thousand. Now between achievements it can definitely be done so you don't have to purchase all five of your builders. Well since since I'm doing that right now I'm waiting on the builders to upgrade uh, I'll go ahead and skip forward, but I'll go ahead and actually try out a raid with these goblins to kind of explain to you. I'll show you what I mean by just going in and farming for those resources. There's different ways to farm for resources. Everybody have different strategies. My favorite for resource farming is goblins. When you get higher up, it's going to require more, but right now, just all goblins will be fine. I just want to fill my resource storages right now. For potions, it's going to be very easy because it's not as big as the gold. I'm looking for something that has more so more potions, and also, you know, like, comment, let me know what you would like to review as far as anything that's going on in the game. I'm trying to decide on what to do as I go along, so. If you got anything that you would like for me to discuss, I'll be more than happy to do so. I'm gonna try to look, that looks like a good amount of resources, but I'm gonna try to look for bigger. Now that's, that's better. Uh, also another video that I'm going to see, as I'm showing you which town halls you should consider skipping and not skipping, I'm going to show you what comes with those town halls, because now as you can see I hold a camp of 50, so it's a ways from that 20. Uh, I got an additional army camp, so that's automatically an additional 20. Let's go ahead and read this.
Again, when you form it for resources, trophy is, trophies are not really important. They're good because they do raise you up in rank. And the higher up you go, the more resources the more resources will be available because you're running into higher players that are capable of holding more. Um, a lot of people find key areas that they like to raid in for resources, but everybody has their own, you know, decisions. But so that's it for this video. Just wanted to show you how I like to run the goblin raids. Um, so again, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if you would like to see, like to see anything, or have me review anything in particular. Uh, so now this is the the road to get to. What should I call it? Uh, the road to get to the clan castle, or the road to the clan. So that's what we're going to work on. Getting these storages so we can go ahead and get this clan castle built and go ahead and join that clan. One other thing, and I just remembered before. I shut the video down or in this video another important thing I'm pretty sure some of you are looking at the basin or wondering what happened to the walls what happened to the build you know it was a totally different format previously before well I made the mistake by not combining the account to the email address so that's something you want to want to do it allows you to play on multiple accounts and the way that you would do that is the way that you would do that is go to settings then you go to Google Plus sign in and then you click here it will pull up the Google email addresses that are linked to the your device here and then you can link the account to the Google Plus uh, email address your Google email address Gmail account definitely important you want to make sure you be able to do it that way you can play on multiple devices if you are not working Android, I believe it's called Game Center that you go through. It does the same thing. And that was pretty much it. I just wanted to make sure I made that known because obviously I had to start all over. I don't have my walls. I don't have my base laid out. But I will. I'll go ahead and purchase the walls once the storage is up. And, and if there's anything else that I feel like upgrading, I will. <laughs> Um, also to kind of give you an idea of other, other YouTube channels that you might want to check out, Daddy is one. He's a moderator. I believe I talked about this in the first video and also God saying that guy is hilarious. Yeah, that guy, <laughs> that guy is hilarious. Um, but he makes some good videos. I have them featured on the channel. Um, so you should check them out and I'm going to review like different websites that you can check out. That has like good resources of uh, information to play the game, different strategies, different builds, things like that. But as for now, we'll see you next time.